In this video I want to show you how to build a better roach trap. You don't want to, I saw somebody put uh, some of the sprays and different bug poisons in their car and you don't want to ride around with a poison capsule. So uh, just make it out of tape. So here's, uh, you see the blue tape here? Let me show you what's on the back side of it. Lots of little roaches. So the good thing about just seeing the little ones, it means that the big ones are probably gone. Well, uh, and you're catching all the little ones, that means they won't spread. Here's another one, another trap. This one's got some big ones in. I looked at it earlier. So you can tell that uh, this has been in here two or three days. So the stuff on the back side of the tape there is just little daubs of uh, peanut butter. And these are um, maybe the size of a dime or smaller. I'd go smaller, but it really works well. And just lay them in there. Uh, you can lay it on the carpet and lay it light gently. Or uh, you can put them on there. I've even put them on the seat. I uh, caught some on the seat like this. Just lay it on the seat like that. But then somebody might come and sit in it. So I put them out of the way. Right here is a good spot. I just touch one, two corners. Uh, some on the other side. Let's see it. Yeah. Yep. See the roaches all over the place? There's going to be a ton of roaches under there. You catch them like this, and you do that for uh, a few days, and you'll knock their population just about out. I've used this to totally clear vehicles of uh, roaches before. I also have another little rig I did with the same principle. This is a clear uh, package like strawberries or I think grapes came in this. And this is really nice. My wife would prefer this kind because uh, but look at the roaches in there. So after we ate the grapes, we just uh, washed it out and I just laid the tape in the bottom with the little spots of, uh, three little spots of, of uh, peanut butter. And so to kill them now, you can either put them in, uh, you can put them in hot water, a bowl of hot water after you microwave it for two or three minutes or you can leave them out in the sun if you want to do that. You can set them on an ant bed if there's an ant bed around, the ants will eat them up. Um, I mean, you could take them out and spray them with the poison, but that defeats my purpose. I don't want to use the poison. To show you one spot that gets a lot of them. Right here in the middle, I guess where we have our drinks and our coffee, uh, you can see the small piece of tape there and I won't lift it up but believe me it is full of roaches now I'll keep doing this for two or three more days maybe uh, maybe longer the good thing is you really don't have to change this out they'll just keep adding and adding and adding to them so to me uh, you can do this in your home you can put it uh, beside the refrigerator they love to be around the refrigerator maybe in front of the refrigerator where the air blows out. And uh, I have uh, I have totally eradicated roaches out of uh, rental houses doing it that way. And that way I don't have to have poison in the house. If there's babies around, little children, I sure don't like to uh, use poison. So it's just an idea, YouTubers. It's a way to build a better roach trap. There might be better ways, but this one really works well. Thank you.